This is the Spotify car thing. And a few months ago, Spotify sent a letter to everybody saying, we're switching gears. As of December 9th, 2024, car thing will be discontinued and will stop operating. So my device didn't get bricked in a few days. Today, I'm gonna be trying to hack it and hopefully not messing up. So we have this amazing tutorial from the company at Desk Thing who is trying to revitalize this to not only be used at a desk, but in car. So we're gonna take this little device and we're gonna hack it with desk thing. I don't wanna do an in-depth tutorial myself because I feel like I'm gonna mess it up. I don't wanna be at fault for someone else's mistakes. So please watch this video and figure out how to do it properly. They did an amazing job. So the device is actually working. It is flashing it. It kept disconnecting and reconnecting right before. So that freaked me out a little bit and I had to fix it. I was using the front IO, decided to put it in the back because the last thing I need is for this thing to disconnect and completely destroy it. It's actually getting done pretty fast. Okay, so this device should be flashed. So now if I plug it in here, it should say Thing Labs. Ooh, look at that. It's saying Spotify now. I don't know if it's supposed to say that. Welcome to Car Thing. Is it supposed to do that? Apparently this is normal, so I guess I have to reset it up. Saying car thing will stop operating after December 9th. So I think I have another flash to do on this. Okay, after some research, this hack does work. Desk thing is pretty much to only use it at your desk. Whereas with this, I can still use the car thing after it dies without worrying about it being bricked, but then still having the original software. If you're just gonna keep it on your desk, I think it's really good to install desk thing and put it on your PC, but if not, just installing the simple flash on it so that Spotify can't take it down, I think that's the best option because now I get to have this device not bricked and keep it for a long time. And especially because now they're getting bricked, these things are gonna be selling for super cheap. The one thing I don't know is once they do brick it, if you can still flash it. So I really don't know how long this is gonna actually work, but I do think that it is worth giving a shot. So yeah, it looks like this device should be running good. And I guess I'll make a video about it if it fails and if I did it wrong and all of a sudden now I have a bricked car thing. So we'll put that in the future. It is gonna get bricked on the 9th. So if you have one, you make sure to one, get your refund. I hope you guys went online and got your refunds and did all of that. They didn't want to refund me at the beginning, but after a lot of persistence, they will refund you. It is the law. You can't just get rid of this. I heard rumors about lawsuits coming from this. I don't know if it will, but there goes mine. But yeah, maybe we'll get even more money. Who knows? But yeah, I'm happy that I did this and hopefully I did it right enough that it'll work and I still get to keep the original UI because I do like this UI. I don't really like the desk thing UI for cars. Like for my desk, it's sick, but not for cars. You should definitely do this to hopefully guarantee that you can still use it afterwards because I like using this in my car. I like using this in my older car, you know, just having this little screen, it makes it very easy. So. So yeah, thank you guys for watching this video. Leave a like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. BBG, out.